side that was very contemporary, wanted to be modern and um, hip. So what we found as well, after meeting with her, she had a few requirements. She wanted a cluster look. She had to have glass. Her mother wanted candelabras. She didn't, so we incorporated that look to mimic candelabras with the sticks and the lights in the bottom. And she also told us that she wanted to use butterflies and she wanted to use the this um, bouquet holder. So and after seeing that type of style she had, and as well as the linens, I could see that her modern was interpreted differently to me than what I would presume modern was. So I tried to stay within the balance of not going like way out there contemporary, like very new style, but modern enough that it would appease her. So we had a budget of $15,000, which sounds like a lot, but it was a very large wedding party. There was 200 guests, so we had to do 20 centerpieces for all the tables. Um, so we came up with a design of having the glass stacked um, three different sizes, as well as um, less is more, doing a lot of beadwork and hanging individual stems of the flowers instead of just utilizing two stems in uh, two stems of orchids in that. Instead, we only used half a, half a stem and used four blooms. We kept the concept going with hanging them on the curly willow to give that natural look, but also the little detail that makes it the wow factor. In her bridal bouquet, I did, um, I incorporated the succulents as well to keep with the theme, so I wired all of those in. I used the Gloriosa Lilies uh, cluster and stuck them in to add the color from the centerpieces as well, and did the beadwork to keep the, the, the theme going. Um, so this was, I thought, as, a, as contemporary as the bride could handle <laughs> from what she um, showed us. As well, we did um, little sushi rolls for the table, for the uh, tray, as well as putting little sushi rolls on top of those. We have the succulents under the bubble bowls, and all she wanted the can uh, napkin holders, so we did napkin rings with wire work, succulents, roses, and had the beads there as well, as well as having the beads and the green pops in all of the faders. And then the, we did the bridesmaids' bouquets as well, with the lonely collar, hand-tied, having the succulent in there, yeah, doing a little bit of the dianthus and the flax, too, because the flax was used in this, in the sushi, to just keep with the and that's and the brides, bridesmaids? These are the bridesmaids. And we'll, we're going to use this in front of the cake then, thereafter. That's what I'm going to be the decoration for that. I'm sorry? Can you bring it over here? Sure thing. <laughs> um, actually, it's in the This one matches. So bring the green things. And <laughs> we use the butterflies on the back. And pretty much the covers don't look good. Oh, and then we're going to take down a couple of these type things for the brunch tomorrow. Not, we'll maybe not, not have it <laughs> as so large, but have um, just take that one down and maybe a couple of the succulents gathered for the brunch the day after because it's a smaller get together.